Hi all, 10K here. So, my friend Noah from Facebook gave me an idea on how to do this SWAT mission a little bit differently. So, let's see what he suggested and see how well it works. So, his suggestion was to use two scouts and to use a bruiser. And the bruiser happens to have Morgan staff, which gives you the area stun. And I, I was lamenting that the assault uh, survivor seems to not be able to take out the armored walkers anymore. And actually, it even seemed like the uh, any of the ranged weapons were having a hard time taking out the armor. So this was his suggestion from Facebook, and we'll see how it works. So his, if we take out that one, and then we take out these two, and the armored walkers don't see you so they don't actually even move. So now you take your area stun and stun those and we're gonna take our scouts and take out the one that's not stunned and we'll take those out and we'll let them come towards us. Alright so take them out Take them out. Take them out. Alright, so now everybody has their charge ability built up. See, we got brain stabs, we got smashes, so we're going to open up the truck, and here comes the armored walkers. So, we're going to use smash to stun those two, and we're going to use brain stab to take that one out, and actually, we got a swift strike so we'll take that one out and we'll take out these two walkers and we'll use Glenn's brain stab to take that one out and there you go the exit is unlocked we've killed everybody and lo and behold three stars so there you go thanks Noah for that suggestion and if you found this useful, please press the like button and please consider subscribing. Thanks for watching.